Managing Excessive Bleeding in Dogs During Heat Hello, pet owners. Today, we're going to discuss a potentially alarming situation you might face if you're the caretaker of an unspayed female dog. Our topic for today is, what should I do if my dog's bleeding during their heat cycle becomes excessive? It's important to know the signs and have a plan in case this happens. Remember, every dog is unique and what's normal for one might not be for another. What is normal during a dog's heat cycle? In a dog's heat cycle, some bleeding is normal. This is a part of the proestra stage, the first stage of the cycle, and can last from 7 to 10 days. But how much is too much? The bleeding at the start of the heat cycle is usually heavy but then gradually decreases. The key thing to remember here is that the bleeding should not be excessive or prolonged. If you notice that your dog is bleeding as much as a human would during menstruation, or if the bleeding lasts for more than 10 days, this could be a sign of a problem. How can I identify excessive bleeding? Excessive bleeding might look like a large amount of blood, or blood that is getting progressively heavier instead of lighter. If your dog's bedding, favorite spots, or any area where she rests is regularly soaked with blood, it might be excessive. Additionally, if your dog seems weak, tired, or more lethargic than usual, it could be a sign of blood loss. Any behavior changes or signs of illness in your dog during her heat cycle should be taken seriously. What should I do if my dog is bleeding excessively? Immediate veterinary care is crucial if you suspect your dog is experiencing excessive bleeding during her heat cycle. Don't wait for the cycle to end. This can be a sign of serious health issues such as a uterine infection or a hormonal imbalance. While waiting for veterinary care, try to keep your dog calm and comfortable. Avoid any strenuous activities and ensure she is drinking enough water. In conclusion, being aware of what's normal and what's not during your dog's heat cycle is crucial. If you notice excessive bleeding, your immediate response should be to seek veterinary care. It's always better to err on the side of caution. Your dog's health and well-being should always be your top priority. We hope this video has been helpful and has empowered you to take the best care of your furry friend.